from this week's edition of the Spartan Spotlight. Hope everyone had a great Halloween. How was yours, AG? So spooky. We went to go talk to Bobby and Ryan to see how the month of October went. As you can see, the leaves are starting to change. You know what that means? October. We didn't want you to miss out on Oktoberfest. We went to go ask some students what they like to do in October. Favorite things I like to do for October, I would say Valley Scare and also Trick or Treat. So, angle first. I really like to go to haunted houses. Uh, Valley Scare is one of my favorites. I like eating pumpkin seed. Um, watching all the little kids run around the neighborhood all excited in their costumes. I like Valley Scare because it's cute guys and I like going on the rides and I like getting scared and Valley Scare scares me. So. I spend most of my time eating candy. Um, I like to hang out with little kids and go and go and not scare carved pumpkins. I like to stay home, um, go on walks during the middle of the day, you know, the, the fresh weather. Things I like to do in October, hang out with my friends, be outside. I'll get some candy and I don't want to miss the October Fest. Other than the things like this, there's corn mazes, pumpkin pie, apple orchards, hail bale rides, Halloween. This is with Bobby and Ryan reporting for Spartan Spotlight. Wow, October really makes me want to kiss someone. Whoa, 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 that's PDA. Man, you went to go see what it's all about. <laughs> oh, hey, Simley. There's a lot of PDA in the hallways. Let's go check it out. In case you didn't know, PDA stands for Public Display of Affection. This includes kissing, hugging, hand-holding, and more. And a lot of students have the same opinion on it. PDA is gross. <laughs> I don't like it. I think it's disgusting. I'm disturbing if you're trying to get to your locker or something. Ugh, why y'all gotta do that? Like, you're gonna see each other next hour. It's gross. Okay, I hate PDA and I hate seeing people kissing in the hallway. Well, I think it's gross. There are a select few who have a different opinion on the PDA. I just really enjoy PDA because it just gets everyone kind of excited. They honestly don't think it's that bad because they like each other and are in love. People kiss all the time, it doesn't really bother me. I'm for PDA if you're hot, I'm against it if you're not. I vote for that. We did interview one new student on if there was PDA at his old school. <laughs> no. I went to an all-guy school, so no. We also asked the health expert for her thoughts. I kind of want to ask kids who are showing me too much in the hallway. If you do this in the hallway, what do you do at home? That worries me. Remember what we talk about in ninth grade health. Too much might be too much. Keep it on the lowdown. Well, there you have it. So please, Simley, keep it rated G. This has been Rampan and AG reporting for the Spartan Spotlight. See you next hour, bitch! <laughs> Well, looks like people aren't really big fans of PDA. Well, I'm a huge fan. Well, I like candy. What are you doing for Halloween this year, Alexis? Not really sure. How about you? Are you going trick-or-treating? Heck yeah, I gotta go get that Twix door-to-door. -door. Ew, Twix! Reese's Pieces all the way. We went to go ask Ellen Grizz, Tierra Johnson, and Elizabeth Playago what their favorite Halloween candy was. My favorite kind of candy is Twix. Um, actually, no, that's my favorite candy. No, it's not. It's I'm not. Pretty, it's not <laughs> Elizabeth and Tierra had a quite a bit of an argument, but we asked some more people what their thoughts about candy was. What's your favorite kind of candy? Lemonheads. That's ratchet. Oh. <laughs> we also asked Jake and Rashad what their favorite kind of candy is. Oh, no! My favorite candy is Snickers! Man, people really do like their candy. Just don't get into a fight about it. Have fun at Halloween this year, Simley. This has been Kayla and Alexis. Corn for this burn spotlight. Yummy. There's a lot of good candy out there. There's also a lot of good jobs. Let's go get the scoop from Kyler. Hey, Simley. I went to see how some students balance their work life with their school life and how they do homework. I interviewed four Simley High School seniors to see how they maintain their job life and their student life. Uh, I work at the UPS store. We get paid seven fifty an hour. Ray's coming up soon. Talk and I guys. get my homework done at around whenever I'm done at about eight o'clock. I work at Pizza Hut over on Robert Street. I get seven twenty five an hour. I work twenty to twenty five hours a week and I do my homework during study hall and then usually at home. I work at Target and I work at Caravan. 
Um, I get paid minimum wage. Yep, same. It's, and it's really hard to do homework at night when we close. So I don't do it. <laughs> um, I get like 20 hours a week. I only get like 15. This man Kyler Smith, reporting for Spartan Spotlight, telling you on how kids balance their work life with their school life. That was a nice story. Turns out Simley is pretty nice too. Me and KP went to go check it out. Oh. Hey Simley, have you wondered how nice our school is? We went and did some experiments to see how nice we really are. This is Jocelyn and she volunteered to drop her books to help us with our first experiment. We went and asked Kylie Boyer why she didn't help. Because I saw one of my friends in the hallway <laughs> and they distracted me. Because I wanted someone to do the same for me. She was walking by in the hallway and it looked like she needed help picking up her stuff. Our second experiment is the same who pays for the suckers and who doesn't. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Does it look good? Mostly I love suckers. And have 25 cents. Yeah, so that's what we did. Yeah. Blue levels. Derek and Kyle claim that they didn't even think about taking the money. You know, that's just taking it too far. Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. wasn't me. <laughs>